Hey guys, it's Rishal here, back with another video. And today I am going to show you how you can enable all the custom ROM features in your LTV L1s smartphone. So, as you people know, there are many ROMs came for this phone, like Resurrection Remix and uh, MIUI, then Cyanogen Mode 13. All those all those ROMs are having so many bugs, but you people are still using those ROMs. Why? Because they are having lots of custom features. So. In my today's video, I am going to show you how you can enable all those features in your stock room. So without getting further ado, let's get started. So the first tweak in today's list is swipe your status bar for brightness control. So this feature is present in Cyanogen Room and Resurrection Remix. And you can enable this in stock room also. Let me tell you. You have to download an app called Exposed Edge. Download this app from Expose Installer and enable the module and restart your phone. And after that, open Expose Judge and go to Preferences. And here you have to you have to select Edge Height and make it to 60, 60 pixel and click OK. And here you will get Gesture Long Press Timeout. Click on that and make it to 100. Click OK. Go back. And here you will find Gestures. Click on it. And you have to select top edge here just click on it and click that arrow and here you will find long press action so once click on long press and go back sorry go down and here you have to select swipe at just and select brightness here so what will happen is you will once you will tap on your status bar and slide it the brightness or increase will increase or decrease so you cannot see my brightness increasing or decreasing but you can still see a blue line here which indicates that the brightness is still increasing or decreasing so this is it for this tweak so the second tweak in today's list is double tap on the status bar to sleep so for that you need one app called gravity box you can enable this option by two ways the first one i am showing you is gravity box go to status bar section and here you will find disable peak so once you will disable peak you will you will try, you will be able to enable double tap on to sleep so enable that and double tap to sleep on the status bar will be enabled so this is the first method to enable that and the second method is exposed edge open the app go to gestures then here you will find top edge you have adjusted long press for swipe adjust brightness and you can enable double tap for screen off so this is it for this tweak so the third tweak in today's list is status bar gestures which action you want to be triggered when you swipe your status bar left or right so this tweak is not present in any of the custom room so for, for enabling that what you have to do is open exposed edge app go into gesture section and here you will find top edge in top edge here there you will find two options swipe left and swipe right in swipe left you can select anything I have selected Wi-Fi so once I will swipe it left it will turn on my Wi-Fi or turn off my Wi-Fi so swiping right by swiping right also you can enable one gesture I have enabled mobile data so once I will swipe it right you can see here on my status bar that 4G is enabled and once I will move it to right the 4G will be disabled so by those four tweaks we have ended up for the status bar part and now we are moving for other customizations and handy features so the first one in that list is swipe back so basically what this app does is when you will slide your uh, when you slide your screen from the left from the right side it will go back it will act like a back button so once you will download the app from the expose installer you have to enable the module and restart your phone and after that we'll go into global settings and here the default will be left you have to make it only right and press ok and go back and suppose if you don't want this app in to act in camera means you can disable it from here 
or any other games that you can that we are playing you can disable from here why because even if you will slide your screen from the right side by mistakenly the app will go back so while you are playing game this app will not be done will, will won't work good so for youtube also you can disable it so this is it for this swipe back quick so the sixth thing that i am going to show you is the music controls so this music controls will work on any stock player so open the gravity box app and here you have to go into media tweaks and once you go into media tweaks you can see select a couple of options here you can see here and uh, you have to enable this one volume key is skip, skip track so what this will do is when your screen will is off and you are playing the song while keeping while holding the power up sorry while holding the volume up or volume down button you can skip tracks so here the other option is more music volume steps so once you will enable it you will get uh, more music steps so here you can see that volume volume panel auto expand so once i will press my volume button uh, you can see here that the expanded i can i will i am getting expanded uh, volume panel and here you can also decrease or increase the time out of your volume panel so this is it for gravity box tweak you can also add other media tweaks by this app exposed edge so here go to gestures and here go to bo bottom edge so by here uh, i have i made these three tweaks double tap on double tap this area you can see this yellow part you can double tap on it or you can slide left or right for enabling these three tweaks so i made double tap for media play pause and swipe left for media previous and swipe right for media next so once i will double tap it you can see that the song is playing and uh, once i will swipe, swipe it so this is a very handy feature that i keep using regularly so the next tweak in today's list is 360 degree rotation so here you can see that i am rotating my screen 360 degree so for enabling this you have to go to gravity box and here go to display and here you can find this setting allow all rotation just enable it and you can able to use this option so the last tweak in today's list is call vibrations so this option is there in LTV 2s but it is not there in LTV 1s so call vibration is nothing but you are you are calling someone and that person has received your call you will get a small vibration and you will be notified that the call has been received so for that you have to download an app called gravity box go there and go to phone tweaks and here you will find call vibrations enable that sorry select that and you have to enable these two options on call connected and call disconnected so once the call will disconnect you will also get a small vibration So these are some of the basic custom tweaks that you can enable in your LTV L1 smartphone without any custom ROM. So if you guys want other custom features then you can comment in the comment box below. I will try to enable those features. Thanks for watching this video guys. If you like this video then please hit the like button and subscribe my channel.